How to use money to make even more money. What's good everybody, welcome back to a brand new video. My name is Reza Murad if you're new here and I like to take you on my journey of starting different businesses, starting different side hustles and making as much money as possible and as well as enjoying them. Let's get right into this video without wasting time. Today's video is about seven ways you can use to make money with the money you already have in your bank account. Doesn't matter if you're poor like me and have a couple dollars hanging around there or if you're rich like Elon Musk and have couple million dollars hanging around there just doing nothing. So let's get right into it. Number one, invest in yourself slash your career. You want to wait for number seven. Before we get into it, you guys want to wait for number seven. That's going to blow your mind. It's no work at all. Number one, as I said, invest in yourself slash your career. This may sound kind of like saying, but how is this going to make me more money? You're saying that I'm invested, I'm using my money to make money, but investing in myself is just me putting money, spending money, but how is it going to make me money back? That's what a lot of mindsets, that's what a lot of people think like. But how I think about it is investing. Here are different th things you can do. Build different skills. Learn new skills. So build the skills you already have, build them higher, get into the next level, but also learn new skills. Again, there are skills that companies pay a hundred thousand, two hundred thousand dollars up to $500,000 a year for you to just do it. And read, read. A book might cost $15. You're investing, you're reading that book, you're gonna learn something, you're gonna experience something just through reading. And keep journal, keep a journal. It manage anxiety, reduce stress, cope with depression, prioritize problems and cope with fear. Better identify uh, that the things that you really need more help with and the things that you're really good at. So keeping a journal actually is really helpful. That was number one, investing in yourself slash your career because this is for long term. Remember, we're thinking long term. We have the smart, the bright mindset to think long term, not just short term, investing $100 there, making $1,000 there, investing $200, making it $400 out. We're thinking long term, investing in a career, investing in a business, investing in something that can grow even bigger in the next decade. Number two, opening a high yield saving account. Now this one may be like, what are you talking about Reza? Come on, you want us to open a high yield saving account? How is that gonna help us make money? But if you don't wanna take no risk, this one is the one for you. Again, I have a couple more that's no risk as well. They're all mostly no risk uh, with little risk. But open a, opening a high yield savings account is actually no risk. Some banks pay, uh, has an APY of 0 0.50, 0 0.55, 0 0.56. Those are markets. Um, uh, the, we have Community Direct and we have uh, VIO Bank. Those are the three that I saw a lot of people, a lot of websites, a lot of videos talking about it. Just remember, this video took me hours and hours of research to have seven different ways for you to use your money you already have to make more money. So if you do appreciate that, smash that like button, smash that subscribe button for more videos just like this and join me on my journey. Number three, develop streams of passive income. Again, you can develop streams of passive income with zero dollars, but you can also develop streams of income with money that you already have hanging around. I've said this so many times today, money you already have in your bank account, money you already have hanging around somewhere over there, but advertise on your car. This one may not seem as accurate as you think about it, but it's absolutely free and you get paid to do it. You may think, oh, if I put this random logo on my car, how are my friends going to think about it? doesn't matter what the others think. It just matters that you're following your dream, making some extra cash and living a life full of freedom. So advertising on your car, creating a blog slash YouTube channel, dividend stocks and rental income. There's a couple ways you can make passive income with putting zero, little to no money at all. Again, rental incomes might have a little more upfront cost, but again, if you are into it, do it. Just jump in, guys. Number four, invest in stocks slash dividend stocks. So the average stock market return is about 10% per year, 10% per year, which is the S&P 500. It's often considered to be the benchmark measure for annual stock market returns. Tough 10% is the average stock market return per year. That's impressive, 10%. Average banks with a 1% interest rate, 2%, 3%, let's even say 5%. But stock markets with an average of 10% interest rate with zero risks. Yes, guys, I'm going to share some stocks right now that has zero risks. So here are some low-risk stocks. 
ETFs, investing ETFs, they are completely, from my opinion, I'm not a financial advisor, but I think there's zero risks, there's no risk in them. Some big worldwide companies like Tesla, Amazon, Google, and Facebook that can invest in, but that, that you are 100% sure that in the long term, again, use that smart mindset of yours and think about the long term. In the long term, you're not going to lose money investing in some big worldwide companies. And here are some good dividend companies like Microsoft with a dividend yield of 0.77% and Coca-Cola with a dividend yield of 2.97%. You can go check out their stocks just searching div uh, their code on Google. The number five or the fifth way you can make money with some money you already have is actually choosing credit cards with rewards you will actually use. Now this one again, remember, you don't need a lot of money to get started. Maybe there are fees for you to pay, but there are some that actually has zero fees zero fees for you guys to pay and you actually get money back by just using the bank's money. So here are some different ways. Uh, traveling, let's say if you're a traveler, choose a credit card that actually pays you for traveling, pays you for a hotel, pays you for different vacations. Let's say you are just a person, a normal nine to five worker, choose a credit card that pays for your grocery or choose a credit card that pays cash back. All of us want some extra money. So there are different credit card options for everyone in this wide world, in this peaceful world. And number six way for you to make money is investing in real estate. Again, this is no risk, but you do need, as I told you in the front of the video, at the start of the video, if you have $5, if you have $100,000, this video is for you. Rental properties. You can invest in uh, real estate in different ways, like rental properties, flipping house, and investing investment groups. And here we come to the final one. I was about to say the name. Here we come to the final one, the seventh way that you can make money with the money you already have in your bank account or in your pocket. And it's called becoming a silent partner in a new business. I don't hear a lot of people talking about this, but this is an amazing way. As I did more research into this, just through this whole video, I did, I think, seven hours of research to make this whole video. And guess what? Three hours of that went into becoming a silent partner. I wanted to know more about it. It just seemed very interesting. Uh, so you want to know what a silent partner is? A silent partner is an individual whose involvement in a uh, partnership is limited to the providing capital to the business. A silent partner is, is seldom involved in the partnership's daily operation and does not generally uh, go in meetings and everything. But they basically invest in, it's basically investing into a new company, but you're also part of it. Let's say you invest into it, but you don't have you don't do a lot of the stuff that the actual people do, the CEO does, the co-founder or whoever it is does. You're just part of it and you provoke some stuff. Again, it says that not generally participating in management meetings and everything like that. So that was seven ways you can make money with the money you already have in your bank account. If you did get some free value, but you guys smash that like button smash the rest of government down below number one was investing in yourself slash career number two was opening a high yield savings account number three was developing different streams of passive income number four was investing in dividend stocks slash just stocks and number five was uh choosing credit cards with rewards that you will actually use number six invest in real estate and number seven become a silent partner in a business in a new business or in a business that you believe in so hope you guys did get some free value i'll see you guys in the next video